Yeah. You were also raising chickens the last time I saw. How are the chickens? Okay, this is a weird thing to say, but they were a rental. <laughs> what? Yeah, they were. <laughs> Because when I got the chickens, I was like, I'll just be this kind of person who's like, hey, I'm, I'm earthy, I have chickens. <laughs> but really, my husband was like, you're not gonna want these chickens for very long. And there was a guy near us, we live in Massachusetts most of the year, yeah. and he rents chickens, kind of like, mm -hmm. m m why not? <laughs> Memorial Day to Labor Day. And um, yeah, That's I, interesting. we got rid of those girls. They, um, they were really yeah. weird. Those hens were hard to handle, okay. Those hens were following my husband around everywhere and I was like, I almost got a little bit jealous. <laughs> like they didn't want to have anything to do with me and they just followed my husband around and then. Did you like having eggs though? That's kind of cool. I've... Here's the thing. Oh. We're getting a, we were getting like one egg every four days. What? They just were weird and they slept on the top of their coop. Lazy chickens. Lazy, yeah. lazy chickens. Pop yeah. them out, girls. What the Pop heck? <laughs> I want some <laughs> eggs. I want some eggs, yeah. You probably had no ticks in the back, right? <laughs> oh, I wish. I mean, not to. Lazy chickens. I know. Not to be a bummer, but yeah, it's a, got a big, a big tick problem in Massachusetts. Well, the Northeast, yeah. yeah in yeah, Texas exactly. as well, where I'm from, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, well, have you ever had any chickens? Chicken. Or, I know, everybody's know like checking gross. themselves. I, did you see, I just did yeah, that too. Everyone yeah, everyone in too. Have you ever had any like, uh, not odd animals, but farm animals or anything like that, other than like a dog or a cat? I've had a horse. Oh, okay. He, he was very important to me. I met him making a f uh, film in Mexico. I, I, st we bonded, we, I had, I couldn't say goodbye, so I had him, sent up from Durango to uh, Pasuarez to El Paso. He got on a FedEx and he f we flew him to New York City. <laughs> a horse flew yes. FedEx. That's the easiest way to get they him really there. They really will deliver everything. Correct. Yeah. They will. And, and he was a, a great companion to my oldest son who has uh, an intellectual disability, he's autistic. And so even if he didn't want to ride, you could give him a brush and a bucket. Yeah. And you know, they're both happy all afternoon. No, know, it's very therapeutic. That. They do that all the time. That's, oh, yeah. yeah, equine therapy. Ex ex absolutely. Yeah, that's cool.